255 here. What up? What up? I guess part of Final Fantasy VII Ever Crisis compilation is First Soldier. They, they do have some important storyline. Maybe that's why Sephiroth, Young Sephiroth is in the end. Because he's supposed to be part of that storyline, but this failed product, we don't really need to see this too much. And if had they put the game on PC, and hopefully, Square Enix has learned from their mistakes and not don't keep this version of Final Fantasy VII only on the phone instead of putting it on console so other players can reach and enjoy it. Another possibility for a remake. Well, I guess. So maybe they'll add a remake to this. It looks like they're adding Crisis Core to this, and that's fine. And you know, as long as they're adding new modes and new versions of Final Fantasy VII Universe is basically what they're doing at this point, they might as well make it an MMO. Allow people to join as actual party members, like one person plays Cloud, another person plays Zach, another person plays Vincent. Or you can have a Sephiroth, Tifa, Barrett party, whatever. I mean, you go online and you can play as those characters. Or you can have those classes, a Sephiroth class, Zack class, different things like that. And a lot of people might enjoy that. Now, this battle system looks like it's turn-based. And those first three, first two look like it's kind of a limit breaker. Higher Braver plus Slashing Thrust, those look like they remind me of Cloud's original first two limit breaks from Final Fantasy 7. Maybe that's why they have three limit, three bars there. And then the other ATB gauges. Uh, I think the graphics is fine. And the funny thing about this, this is exactly what they did in Final Fantasy 7, the original. In the original Final Fantasy 7, they had graphics like this, but when the battle came out, the graphics were actually better looking from the battle than it was in the actual game. Not that these graphics don't look good, but they, they do look good, they're enjoyable. Uh, this game also has new scenes, as we'll see coming up. And it's also going to have new text, as I've noticed from the trailer. I'm gonna point that out as soon as that comes out. I like the idea of them adding Zach to this. They probably like it more, like right here. Uh, I don't remember these lines being the original Final Fantasy 7. And then, shut up, Shinra Scum? I don't remember that in the original. I don't remember this being in the original, at least not here in this part. I know they talked about there being a detection system, but that was more when they were on the train, not where they were in Seventh Heaven. So, here, another example of a new scene. And I'm okay with them taking liberties to make a new scene, but he's got to bring this to con. So I think ultimately, hopefully they'll bring this entire game to PC, PlayStation, all the consoles, and they're going to make it a live service permanently, not just on here. And this live service won't fail because fans actually love Final Fantasy VII. So the game won't fail. And they will be able to take a look at things like this, this new costume. So they're going to be selling us costumes. Why did they choose the symbolism of a wedding dress? That's definitely an anarchy. I'm glad to have this slowed down now. And that looks like some type of new limit burst or attack. I don't remember seeing that in Final Fantasy VII Remake. And I darn sure don't remember seeing that attack actually in Final Fantasy VII. Barrett's one shot, I remember that. And so if they're going to be using Final Fantasy VII Remake assets to fill in the battle scene and make it in turn base you can't it's just annoying that they're allowing this to be used as a way to take more money from the fans <laughs> and the key way they're doing that is what we see on the screen adding new possibilities giving us a fangasm like this is an ultimate timeline but this is cheating this right here is cheating and that this is not in final fantasy 7 remake or rebirth however they choose to do it is kind of like come on square enix i know you need to make your money and you know how much we love sephiroth but don't do this right don't do this but they're gonna do it because we're gonna buy it anyway that's it thoughts ideas as always hit the like button smash that subscribe on the way out most people viewing my videos 
or not subscribed. All right, 255 out one.